So when you're working on your background lines, you wanna make sure that if you're not comfortable creating straight lines with your ruler or creating the curved lines that are needed in the alternating sections, you should really practice that on a separate piece of paper before you work on your background. Here are some examples of what not to do. So you do not want to have straight lines. You do not want to have lines that are really close together or lines that have uneven spacing. You also don't want your curved arced lines to look bumpy or to look like they're not matching. So if this is something that you're not comfortable doing yet, then you should practice this on a separate piece of paper before you do it on your graded project. So let me show you what not to do when you're making your sphere. Once you have your vertical and horizontal lines on your paper and you put your little marks, what you do not want to do is you do not want to make straight lines that are going to like a point. You'll see that this is creating a different type of look. These are creating angles. We do not want angles. We instead want a really smooth arc. We do not want to create points. So see the difference between this side and this side. This side has these points. This side has a smooth arc. So this may be something that you want to practice in your sketchbook or on a separate piece of paper before you do it on your project paper.